Welcome back everybody, it's Burner as always and I am ecstatic to be bringing you this video because we have an individual level up tournament and I cannot be more excited and you'll see why in a little bit. Uh, so let's get into it. Here you see everybody's favorite Walker Samurai Michonne introducing our level up and as you can see top prize is Epic Sophia. Also, there will be some smattering of ultra rare and elite gear. Let's get into the specifics of these rewards. Uh, here we see the specific uh, objectives I have starting out, but let's go to the rewards. And let's take a peek at these rank rewards. First place we have Sophia. If you aren't familiar, I think Sophia is a great tune, especially if you're running yellows. But let's take a closer look. Adrenaline Rush, dam Damage and Defend. 45 very fast AP she's doing 450 percent damage to one and also plus 50 percent defense buff for two turns really quality she's also a good leader for yellows because she's boosting all fast 45 percent hit points and that can make a huge difference uh, when you're going up against stronger individuals in raids you know lack of a specialist skill but let's be honest you can't get everything right Overall, she's definitely a really quality 5-star, especially one that you can win through individual effort. And second, we have All Out War Jesus. I'm a little torn on uh, this tune in general. Uh, let's see why. Adrenaline Rush, Dizzying Strike, Recharge Rate 106. And that is why I'm torn on him. Let's look at it though. He deals 300%. An impair for two turns to one enemy in all adjacents. Uh, specialist, he has parting uh, shot. You know, it's, it's a tiny plus. But really, this adrenaline rush is the thing that puts me on the fence. The effect of the adrenaline rush is pretty OP. If you can manage this thing to go off and freeze everybody on the screen for two turns, you know, it almost doesn't matter what they have left. You'll probably be able to mop it up. But the fact that it's 106 makes it really hard. Uh, maybe if you can buff him, uh, put him in a team with uh, Morgan, he might have some better value. But you got to have specific pieces to make him work. And for 3 through 10, we have Green Rosita. Adrenaline Rush gear up, recharge rate 75, you know, not terrible. Uh, all teammates get 55 defense and plus 30 crit. No leader skill. And specialist tenacity, you know, it might save you one out of every ten. Uh, not a huge plus there. Uh, but basically with her AR, it kind of puts her more in sort of a, a walker team area without a leader skill. I mean, 55% defense uh, can help you out in raids and, you know, tower defense, things like that. But not quite as quality is, you know, something that, that you really want. Uh, you know, if you have her, and you don't have a lot of five stars, I'd definitely try and find a way to use her in a team, but you know, she's not gonna be something that you build a team around. But the main reason I'm really excited for this is you can see three through 10 is gonna walk away with a five star. If you're free to play, this is what you've been hungering for as far as level up. I've been in a lot of prep for a while, and unfortunately, the last few level ups have been top two, top three, get a five star. And I wasn't sure that I had enough resources and preparations to make that work. And like I've said before, nothing's more disheartening than spending a lot of time and patience to make a run at an event and come up short. But 10, to, 10 through 3, I don't want to jinx myself, guys, but I'm going to walk away with a five star from this. And I'll keep you updated along the way. I don't know if it's going to just be Rosita. I feel like I have enough preparations and enough characters to level up that I could possibly get in that first place spot, but it might be a matter of uh, whether or not other people out there want it more than me and have more time to put in. But I think as far as resources and prep, I'm definitely capable. We'll see how that goes. Let's go now and take a closer look at the uh, milestone rewards. You know, pretty average for... Uh, our level ups, you can see if you get to the uh, higher levels, you start getting personas and trainers. And then if you can get up to 100,000, you get that flag and that universal trainer. You know, pretty standard. Nothing nothing too surprising. It's always good to get to the top if you can. 
since I say preparations a lot, let's go ahead and take a peek at what I have here. Going to the first training ground, this one's active. You can see I got 800 already, 980 queued up, uh, so still working on 180. My next one, I have 1850 uh, military. These are uh, soldier trainers, or soldier characters rather. And then in my third, I have 1860. My fourth, I'm actually leveling up to a, a TG20 right now, so it, it unfortunately doesn't have anything in it. But, you know, I have a good fair amount of tunes going, cooking, and they are ready to get eaten up and fed. So let's do some feeding. Uh, you can see I got a 155 out of 115. You know, I haven't had a long time to cram since the uh, faction level up, but you know, I've shown you guys what I do have stored. Uh, so let's go ahead and try to burn these down. Like I said, it can be a little slow at the beginning of a level up uh, because you have to kind of get rid of all these characters you've crammed in there. So to do that, I'm going to take a peek. I'm going to try and attack objectives first. Uh, try and take out, you know, Adrenaline Rush first, one, because I prep for it. It usually only takes three characters, and that's going to help me get rid of them pretty quick. Uh, so for this first one, we have Hunters. Let's find our, our friend Timothy here. And just to burn through some of these twos, uh, oh, I guess I'm going to need some food before I do this, huh? All right, let's go ahead and, uh, <laughs> let's go ahead and show you how to get food, you know, again, those are all ready. Pull them in. That's how I always start it. Now we have our farms cooking whether or not they were holed up or not. Back to Timothy. Let's level him up. I'm going to show you guys something I try sometimes. Uh, it's where I'll mix a guarantee AR level up with um, some of the persona. Uh, and You know, I don't really know that it works, but I try it and sometimes it works. So uh, if I have them sitting around, I'll usually do this. Yeah, only plus one. You know, it's not 100%. Uh, it's probably more of just a superstition for me that makes me feel good. Uh, plus one again. Uh, that's all right. We were going to burn through those guys anyway. Let's get our third one in. Boom. You know, 5,000 bonus. It's that easy. It's that quick if you're prepared for it. What's our next one? Uh, rare, better, strongs. All right. Let's, um, let's go in here and take a peek. I'm not terribly certain who I have that's strong. It's easy to... Get up right now. Let me look. Yeah, I don't think I have that. Michonne. Uh, oh, Sh wait, Shane. I think I have a couple. Yeah, there's two, three. Okay, I got Shane. He's also tier three, so there's a tier three hunter objective right now. So let me get him AR'd. Let's do one. Where'd he go? There he is. And since I can get these tier three points. Let me go ahead and just feed him some more tunes. I'm going to go with two stars since he's tier three. Uh, no use wasting money on that one. Let's see what we get. We got our plus one. You know, got some of those tier hunter uh, points in. Let's go ahead and get this, uh, this AR finished off. More Shane. Okay. Well, there we go. Uh, now we're out of Shane's. What to do, what to do. Um, you know, you know, I might, let me go take a look at my other options. Sorry guys, I know it's a little boring. Like I said, this first initial part is, you know, it's a little tiresome just to get back down to where you can start pulling from the training ground. Um, you know, I got this Michonne. I think she's tier 50 though, or not tier 50, level 50. I think she's maxed out. I don't know if her AR is. Let me take a peek. There she is. Uh, well, her AR is not leveled up. Ah, I kind of have. Even though you know, I've said in the past, I burned through all these threes uh, to get a five. You know, I'm not worried about the supply points. You know, I really don't want to make a waste of them just for an AR. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see. You know what? Let's check him out. Lee is a leader, and I have these uh, leader trainers. So uh, let's pop one of these babies, and I'll, I'll run these guys out because he's low level, and I need to get rid of him anyway. So that's our last one. We got another bonus, 5,000. Uh, let's see what they have next for us. Um, all right. Hey, Anarchy. Uh, that means we're going to our Rebel Sandy. We got a bunch of her saved up. Let's kind of make it quick. 
Sandy, and let's just pop all three of them. How's that sound? There we go. Bam, 5,000. That quick. No way around that one. Uh, let's come back out. Where are we at now? 123 out of 115. Uh, like I said, it's a little slow. And we have... Oh, we got to do tough characters. You know what? I might cut it off here, guys. Uh, I'm going to jump out and uh, try and get this down below 115 and then come back and show you some more leveling. For now, guys, I'm Burner. Flame out.